In this second part of the bench press, please be seated, please gallery tour, we'll begin with Melinda Brown. She's a writing artist, a social activist, a poet, and founder of KFOI Radio, a progressive North State radio broadcast. In her benches, Melinda delved into the self-referential meta realm of art. Ponder utilizes a repurposed oak coffee table stained in subtle fall color hues and has a bed of oak leaves suspended in its core. The curve of the shape evokes a pond or a drop of water. Leaves appear to float on the surface. Ponder is a twist on a classic bench for quiet contemplation by a pond. However, this bench becomes the pond. 58 inches long, 38 inches deep, and 18 inches high. Levels of Perception is also by Melinda Brown. Through the open angle of this piece, the artist represents an invitation to share a time and a place to make room for another. It takes us further into the levels of the plane, sharing the structure with what could be a step, a bench, a table, an altar, or an archway. These levels are suspended with minimal support, creating an airy, ephemeral view. The overall size is 40 inches wide, 40 inches deep, and 90 inches high. Pining Away For You has a compact, sturdy form with pleasing proportions. It is Melinda Brown's third bench creation. It stands both inviting and thwarting. Constructed with thick pine planks, its presence is sedate. And then the pine needles embedded in the surface reclaim their former territory on the tree, in the wood grain, making this bench unsuitable. The pine needles revenge. You'll have to find another place to sit. This bench is not for you. The overall size is 42 inches long, 19 inches high, and 14 inches deep. Melinda's two-dimensional piece shows us some of her design elements and approach to the project. Stan Sowers is a Montgomery Creek artist, regionally well known for his sculpture in ceramics and wood. Here Stan opens the exhibition with his troubled water bench. It's brightly colored carved wood bench. It's both inviting and daunting. It makes me wonder where we sit with the current environmental, political, economic climate. Its overall size is 40 inches long, 12 inches deep, and 19 inches high. Seating for Two, original art bench, were the two criteria requests to artists participating in this exhibition. Stan Sowers created hand-to-hand -hand and face-to-face. -face. These almost four foot tall sculpted wooden hands offer a seating option for two in the most embracing form, a sculptural love seat of sorts, 44 inches high, 39 inches wide, and 21 inches deep. Blending personal metaphor Layered narratives and humor, in my opinion, may be Stan Sauer's signature style. In this, his third bench creation, Tongue in Cheek, he takes a giant step from sculpture into sculptural functional furniture. Almost five feet long and three feet wide, this bench cinches a line in his resume as a furniture maker. Stan's two-dimensional piece masterfully illustrates his colorful imagination. Well-known artist Colleen Berry puts her fantastic assemblage skills to work in her raven's roost bench. Standing at almost four feet high and five feet long, you can search and find hundreds of unique, fascinating objects nestled in a bench of refined tree roots and branches. The scene is overseen by sculpted forest creatures and ravens. This bench deserves viewing the details closely to discover the hand-sculpted animals and a myriad of objects masterfully woven in, like no one other than Colleen can do. Colleen's two-dimensional drawing illustrates her early thoughts about ravens.